Now, the next question we'll approach is question two. The question says, calculate the percentage of custom oils and finishes. What you are, what you are, the percentage of the compound or the substance being sought after. In a sample of rock, if a 0.995 gram sample, which is this is for the this is for the weight sample, produce a precipitate of calcium carbonate weighing this amount. Now you are aware that the percentage of calcium oxide, the formula that we, that we all speak of formula gravimetry, is that the weight the weight here is 0.298 multiplied by the gravimetric factor, which I will determine from the data given to me, multiplied by 100 over the sample, which is 0 0.9958. So, we move to the gravimetric factor. You are aware that gravimetric factor is equal to the substance that is being sought after over the, uh, the, as in, as in the molar mass of the substance sought after over the molar mass of the substance that is being worked now. Is being weighed, and the formula for the formula uh, the formula weight of calcium oxide is equal to which is 14.08 plus 16. When you divide it, you be having to be 56.0 what now 08. Now the why the formula weight of calcium calcium trioxide four is equal to 40.08. Plus 12.01 plus, which is 30 times oxygen, which is 16, and that should give me, uh, that should give me, that's 100 points, what now? That's 100.02, 100 100.02. Now we move ahead quickly. So we just become, the remnant of that becomes 56.08 over 100.02. Which when I divide the C point zero two and stop zero eight divided by hundred point zero two that should give me zero point five six zero six nine. So we calculate yes now equal to so in place of the gravimetry factor now we put this uh we put this um, data then I become 0 0.2938 multiplied by 0 0.56069 times 100 over 0 0.9958. When I do my multiplication and division, I should be having. My answer to be okay, sixteen point five four percent in two decimal places. So we moved very fast to the next question. Okay, the next question is calculate the percentage of tri uh, of sulfur trioxide in a sample of ginseng if a 1.7560 gram sample produced a precipitate, okay, that's like an error here, a precipitate of, like a precipitate of barium sulfate weighing 1.9875 gram. Simple. So what do we do? We, you are aware, the same pattern, percentage of the SO2 is equal to, just know the, uh, the formula. The weight sample here, you should know that the weight sample here is 1.9875 multiplied by the gravimetric factor, which we don't know, which we can calculate for multiplied by 100 over that of the uh, sample is 1.7560 gram. Now we move straight away to uh, the gravimetric factor. Now, before we can get to the gravimetric factor, we must know how to calculate. For the molar mass of the, the formula weight of SO3 and also the formula weight of the barium sulfate. Here is the sulfur is 32.064 plus uh, 3 times 16, which is 48. They give me what now 80 point, uh, 
80.064. Yeah, barium here yeah, is 137.034 plus sulfur is 32.064 plus that's 64. Everything here should be equal to as equal to 233 as 233.098 as 233.098 so that's the formula with so that your remaining factor now is not equal to what is equal to 80.064 divided by 233.098 when you divide you should be having it to be as 233.098 should be equal to uh, 0 0.3435 so that the percentage of SO3 is not equal to 1.9875 multiplied by the dimension factor which is 0 0.3435 that is 100 over 1.7560 and the final answer should give me as 38 as 38.876 as 38.876 percent that is the final answer uh, for more uh, questions for more vi uh, uh, for more questions for any comment you can do well to subscribe to my youtube video uh, to my youtube channel and uh, ask a question anytime you want to ask a question on the comment section on my youtube channel i can remain my humble self and Donalyn, and I wish you guys the best. God bless you.